Alright, hey guys, so this is episode number two of Ryan Learns How to Cook. Um, I have a couple more things written down for this this one. These are a little bit more thought thoughtful put together. Uh, so, here we go. Um, baking soda and baking powder. Apparently, I've been informed there is a difference between them. They're both leaveners or they help make things rise, but I guess uh, chemically speaking they are different and you may not necessarily want to change them out for each other. Um, and then also then omitting them completely is probably the reason why I get flat cookies sometimes. Uh, so that's, that's a new one for me. I know they exist, I just didn't really ever think about why like they sit next to each other in the cabinet and they're white, and they're powdery. I'm like, okay. Uh, if there was a tape on it, then I wouldn't know. I mean, it looks like sugar, but just don't, don't put that stuff in your mouth. That's not gonna, not gonna end well. Um, salt. So apparently, there's about twelve kinds of salt. Uh, we have, I've been told four. So I googled uh, because I was curious. I didn't know there was twelve kinds of salt. Um, the, the the Himalayan light, the the salt lamps. I get that. Uh, there's red Hawaiian salt, which obviously is red. Um, I googled that, and to me, it looks like pop rocks. I'm sure it doesn't taste the same. I'm sure it's going to be pretty gross if you just put a whole bunch of red salt in your mouth. Uh, black salt. There's a couple different kinds of black salt. Looks like gravel. Probably tastes better, but looks like gravel. Uh, and then the other day we were in, in Sam's Club and Laura pointed out that there's lavender uh, colored salt. I don't know if that actually tastes any different or somebody just decided to dye it a lavender color. But uh, now we're just throwing things into the rainbow of salt. And then also with with that, the, the partner of salt is uh, peppercorn. Um, not the vegetables. I, I googled peppers and came up with 600 kinds. Um, peppercorn is the correct verbiage to use there. Uh, we have two out of uh, six, apparently. Um, maybe more. Not exactly sure, but there's at least six for sure kinds of pepper, peppercorn. Uh, we have, we have them. Um, but they come in, in a wide array of colors again. Uh, we have white, black, uh, pep peppercorns. Um, there's a Szechuan type, and then there's a Tella Cherry. I'm probably not saying that right, but Anywho, uh, confusing nonetheless for someone who's new into this whole realm. Um, and then my brain got the best of me, so I continued to Google. Um, I like to Google uh, essential spices to have. Um, it lists off 15. So it's black peppercorns, cayenne pepper, chili powder, cinnamon, cloves, cumin, curry powder, garlic powder. Um, if you saw the other video, you know me and garlic chips have a relationship. Uh, ground ginger, kosher salt, dried oregano, smoked paprika, which I've had, which is really good. Um, dried rosemary, dried thyme, and then vanilla extract. Now, my wife saw this list, and she kind of list, 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 and she kind of laughed at me, uh, because we have about 60 or 70 different kind of spices. Uh, and we buy them in bulk, so that was a surprise. Um, didn't really know there was the essentials, apparently, to have a good pantry spice uh, set up, but apparently we leave that in the dust with everything we've got. So, still learning. Um, not a lot of fun stories in this one, it's just, it's, it amazes me that there's so much stuff out there. And, being visually challenged, it's always fun when you grab the wrong thing and what you think is one thing, it turns out to be another. Uh, so, yeah, we're gonna go and continue and cook some more stuff uh, and um, throw it out there for you guys to see. So subscribe, please, to our, our channel so you get the new stuff right away. Um, comment, like it, if you don't, or dislike it, I don't care. Just let us know that you're watching. Um, I hope you're enjoying it. It is actually a lot of fun for us, and have a good evening, and we'll check you later. Bye.